Warning, this content is not made kid-friendly, it's a parody, comedy purpose and falls under fair use. This video contains scenes that are very loud, graphic, or violent in nature. These content may not be suitable for young audiences, so please beware. But remember, don't you ever re-upload or steal my videos and any stuff without my permission or giving me a credit. Hey mum. What is it Pepper? And what does George wants as well? Can we please go to McDonald's? No. But mum, we're hungry. So let's go to McDonald's. Pepper, I said no. Let's go to McDonald's. For the last time Pepper, the answer is no. We want McDonald's. 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 We're not going to McDonald's and that's final. Hey honey, there are no more food left in the fridge. Did you hear that? There's no more food left in the fridge. So we can go to McDonald's. I will like a cheeseburger, large fries, and a regular Coke. And I'll like to have six chicken nuggets, regular fries and a regular Fanta please. Okay, here you go. And here is your change. Thank you for choosing McDonald's. Please come again. Thanks. Welcome to McDonald's. How may I take your order? I would like to have a quarter pounder with regular fries and a regular diet coke. And we will have nine chicken nuggets, large fries, large coke, and two fruit bags. I'm sorry, but there are no more fruit bags left. What? Please tell me that you're joking. Don't feel bad. How about if you have a chocolate milkshake instead? Why? Because Pepper and George, there are no more fruit bags left. Why don't you have a chocolate milkshake instead of the fruit bags? No way. We want fruit bags. Yo. Pepper and George, stop acting like a spoiled brat. You can either have a chocolate milkshake, or you can have no him at all. I got a better idea. Why don't we go across the street and buy a diamond ring, so you can't engage us? Pepper and George, enough with all that nonsense. Now everyone is staring at us. So you're not going to engage us, Mum? Huh? Very well. We will engage at McDonald's. <laughs> Why You're going home and you're getting absolutely nothing. What one 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 Stop crying Pepper and George. It's your own fault. Stop crying like babies. It's totally it's your own fault. Mum, all we want is two fruit bags, but they didn't have one. So we can ask you to engage us. No. The reason why you didn't get two fruit bags because they're none left, so the guy just asked if you have a chocolate milkshake instead. But no. You have destroyed McDonald's and now I believe we are ended up in the news and get into trouble. 
This is never have weren't you acting like spoiled brats. Okay mum. We're sorry. Sorry will not work anymore. You got a slate of trouble today. You also kick out all the people away. How dare you. I should never asked if we go to McDonald's today. Okay mum. We're so sorry. Can at least go back to McDonald's and get nine chicken nuggets, large fries, large coke, and two chocolate milkshakes. No. You have destroyed the entire McDonald's restaurant. I guess we are ended up on the news and get us into lots of trouble. There was fire everywhere, the police was also there. We must get out of here or we will get into tons and tons of trouble. Thanks a lot for this Pepper and George. I think we get into extremely deep trouble Pepper and George. You're grounded for all time. You will get nothing for life. When we get home, you will go upstairs to your room. Good afternoon. Welcome to GNN News. I'm Metal Sonic. Today's top story is about two pigs has destroyed the entire McDonald's restaurant because they didn't get what they have want. We now go live at Lumpkin at the destroyed McDonald's restaurant. Lumpkin. Here I am at the destroyed McDonald's restaurant when a horrible thing happened. Two pigs named Peppa and George didn't get what they wanted and as a result, they have destroyed the entire McDonald's restaurant. And as you can see, the entire McDonald's restaurant has destroyed. All of the tables and chairs has ripped apart. And the counter has been destroyed. And all of the food and drinks has been spoiled. And here me to report is the clack of the McDonald's. Sir, can you tell me and everyone on GNN News about what happened? Well, there are no more fruit bags for the pigs. And so I offered them a chocolate milkshake. But no one they started to go out of control. They then pointed their finger to their mother, and they destroyed the entire McDonald's restaurant. It was horrible. Luckily, I was not badly hurt though. Thank you for the information, sir. Here I am back at outside at McDonald's restaurant with two guests, Princess Matilda and Flutter Girl. They will tell us some information about what happened. Flutter Girl. Can you tell me and everyone on GNN News about what happened when Peppa and George destroyed the entire McDonald's restaurant? Well, me and Princess Matilda wanted to get something at McDonald's today. But when we walk in, their two pigs named Peppa and George started to get out of control. And Peppa and George wanted to engage her. They pointed a finger at her. They felt that they wanted to marry her. Were very scared and went out of McDonald's. What's wrong with Peppa and George these days? Thanks for the update Princess Matilda and Flutter Girl. We hope that you're both safe. We now return to the GNN News Studio with Metal Sonic. Thanks, Lumpkin. I'm now joined in the studio where some vistures. Peppa, George and their mother. Is anything to say to us? Yes. Those kids didn't get what they wanted. And because of this, they asked they could engage them. They then pointed their finger at my face. And then they destroyed McDonald's. They felt like they married me. It was so crazy. But mum, it was your own fault. We didn't get what we wanted. Shut up Pepper. It's your own fault. If you don't start like spoiled brats and pointed your finger on my face and destroyed McDonald's. None this could happen. I just told her we were so 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 sorry. We asked could we get nine chicken nuggets, large fries, large coke, and two chocolate milkshakes, but no. We're now grounded for all time. As now you can see, Pepper George and their mother making fun up. And Pepper and George are now crying because they didn't get what they wanted. Don't worry sir, when we get home, Pepper and George are now even more grounded for all time. Pepper and George is wearing diapers and forced to watch primetime shows. Come on Pepper and George, we're going home now. Stay tuned for more news at 6 p.m. This is all your fault, Pepper and George. You're grounded, grounded, grounded for all time. And you're forced to wear diapers. Ouch. That hurts. I don't care. You'll be taking pee pees and poo poos in your diapers instead of the toilet. And I will burn all your underwear and destroy the toilet. Now go upstairs to your room now while I order the Simpsons DVD apostrophe S out from Amazon. What?